We just got through doing the treetops canopy tour over closer to home base. Now we're way up on top of a mountain with one heck of a view. This is called the gravity zip line. It's a lot faster and a lot more wide open than the last one we did the uh, treetops tour. Ready? All right, Steven, you've officially graduated with an 1,800 foot zip line here. Well, lay it on me, brother. If you can look down, you can barely see where it is we're going to. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. But uh, it'll take me about 50 seconds to get down there to the other side. And uh, I'll be about this big, almost like an ant. This is what West Virginia's all about right here. If I don't make it, Dwayne, tell my mama I said I love her. This is kind of our more intense version of the treetops tour. We're zipping over 1,800 feet between these two mountains, over 200 feet off the ground. A little more intense, a little faster, a little longer. And it's one of the most scenic views in Fayette County. You can see all the New River watershed and the Golly River watershed all at this spot. love West Virginia, if you love mountains outside, and anything, anything you could possibly imagine you could do, it's, it's here. So come see us at Adventures on the Gorge. For all you fellow West Virginians, if you've never had a chance to come down and check out the New River Gorge area, you ought to come down and check out the folks here at Adventures on the Gorge. Just like Tabitha here, everybody's completely friendly, shows you one heck of a time, and I can't wait to tell all my friends about it back home and come back and see these folks again. Thanks for zipping with us. Thank you, Tabitha. I had a blast out here today. Thanks. I'll never forget it. So hey folks, after all that zip lining this morning and afternoon at Adventures on the Gorge, we worked up an appetite and we had to stop by and get something to eat. A few weeks ago while I was out riding my street bike, I discovered this really cool, really hip little sandwich shop located right in historic downtown uh, Fayetteville called the Secret Sandwich Society. And now I'm here with Tasha, one of their co-owners. We're doing a sandwich shop. We do all kinds of different things. We're definitely trying to use a little bit more interesting ingredients, a little bit more surprising factor to your average sandwich. So we have interesting ingredients like bacon jam and uh, we do a seasonal fruit chutney. We also have an evening supper club that's once a month or more more people that sign up. So you can look at us up online, www.secretsandwichsociety.com or visit us on our Facebook website and uh, check out the menu and come by next time you're in town. Folks, they got a mean sandwich here. You got to stop by and check it out. Come by and see Tasha. We had a heck of a
a time riding the Hatfield McCoy Trail System located in beautiful southern West Virginia. This weekend we rode the Pinnacle Creek Trail System and the brand new highly anticipated 12 mile connector trail linking Pinnacle Creek to Indian Ridge over in Ashland. Once we were over in Ashland we decided to ride down the street and check out our old friend Jerry to Riders Paradise and have one of those world famous cheeseburgers. Then we doubled back over to Pineville to check out the Labor Day celebration. While we were there I ran into an old friend of mine who had just experienced a new sport up in Fayetteville, West Virginia called zip lining. So I decided I had to go up and give it a try. We got up the next morning, rode up and saw our new friends at Adventures on the Gorge. And first up we did the Treetops Canopy Tour, which was through the beautiful hemlocks right here in southern West Virginia. And then next up we did the Gravity Tour, which was high speed, long distance. I really enjoyed it. Boy, we worked up an appetite after that. So then we decided to go down to the Secret Sandwich Society and have a nice sandwich in downtown historic Fayetteville. It's been an action-packed weekend, folks, and if you ever get a chance to come down and visit some of these places here in southern West Virginia, you ought to come down and check them out. Be sure and tune in next week to see where the trail takes us next. My name's Steven Anderson, and we'll catch you next time on the trail. I've had some uh, incredible adventures before, but this is awesome. <laughs> Good job, dude.